We're back on Project Last Chance. Today we're gonna to be installing the fuel cell, uh, running some brake lines, fuel lines, and start knocking out this punch list. So let's get after it. Big shout out to my dad today for coming over and helping me out. We got a lot of work to do today. I feel kind of bad putting them to work. We got a Boyd fuel cell with their in-tank EFI fuel pump, um, along with some other goodies. So we're gonna open this up right now and see what this looks like. Man, so just getting a first look at this thing, and it's very nice. All right, let's sit her down. All right, let's get to work. We didn't get much accomplished yesterday. We had to uh, go get some fasteners. We had to paint a couple things. And uh, we're at the phase now where you can't really move forward without getting things done in a certain order. So we got the fuel cell mocked up. It's not installed yet, but I'll be installing that soon. Uh, we'll be doing the fuel filter soon. We got it mocked up and in place. We got a couple of brake lines run. But right now, I gotta go meet Angel down in South Florida because I got some parts for him and he's got some parts for me. guys we just got to Wawa met Angel up here he's gonna give me a core support and an, an OG core support it's powder yes. coated too right yes nice yeah, so I'm dropping off these parts to him he's building a uh, 69 70 blazer 70 70 blazer four-wheel drive to two-wheel drive conversion and I happen to have a trailing arm cross member and some small parts for him so we're gonna swap parts and I'm gonna use this radiator support for my truck but I want to check out his new OBS so man why don't you tell us a little bit about this thing yeah, man, in 1999, I just got. Um, I've always been pretty fond of the two wheel, you know, the two door, two wheel drive lasers. And I had the OBS, and it's kind of tough with the baby and, you know, the wife in the middle and oh, me. I know all about that. So, <laughs> you know, I, fi I figured, hey, man, this thing is perfect. It still has, it's still an OBS, and, yeah. you know, I can shove my, my kid in the back and my wife in the front, and we can ride. But yeah, it, it ran pretty good, man. I mean, 80 miles? miles an hour. It's got 213 on it. I just, I just flipped 213. How many miles is it up here? Uh, like I think it's like spots. 120, something like that. Ran great. No problem, man. It's ran really good. Oh, yeah. yeah, man. Cruise control, you know, riding out. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> Hell yeah. We're going to get these parts swapped out and I'm going to hit the road because I got more work I got to do today. But Angel, I get, appreciate get it, man. Get that C10 done, baby. Get that C10 on the road. <laughs> <laughs> Buddy. 
We've made some really good progress over the last couple of days. We got our Boyd Welding fuel cell installed with the fuel lines and fuel filter. We got our disc brake kit installed with our brake lines. If you guys have any questions on the build up to this point, please comment below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you have any video suggestions or if you want to direct message me, you can always contact me on Facebook or Instagram. That's going to do it for this video, guys. We'll see you in the next one.